What's up guys, Cyber Houdini here, and welcome to something a little bit different. Your new Assassin's Creed has just been revealed. Long rumored to be Assassin's Creed Kingdoms, or Valhalla, or Ragnarok. But it, they have confirmed it's all about Vikings. I think after the success of God of War, it seemed like a, a no-brainer. But it's about time that they actually went to, to Vikings, right? All we're missing now, is, we've got ancient Egypt. All we're really missing now, for me, is like traditional Japan. But Ghost of Tsushima is kind of just kind of filling that void. Bam! All right. Yeah. So I'm gonna. Uh, we're just gonna break down the trailer, read up a few little things I've heard so far, and then we're gonna play some GTA San Andreas. Does that sound like a good time? Let me see. Let me see. A panel. I gotta double check we're live because uh, uh, Twitch has been crazy lately. Oh my god. Alright, I think I think we're live. I'm not getting the mobile dashboard or anything. It's down. There it is. It just took like fucking five minutes. Alright, cool. I'm glad. Nice. Yeah, so this was. It was kind of a weird way they announced it, I'm not gonna lie. Like, after, what was it, the Fallout 76 where they had the Vault Boy in front of a camera for 24 hours? What the hell was that about? So, with with this, I don't know if they're taking a page out of their book or what, but with Ubisoft, they decided to hire graphic designer Boss Logic. You guys might know him, he's pretty, pretty popular. Uh, and he decided to paint this, this beautiful concept art live. I think it took nearly eight hours or something. It was a huge project. It, it, it kind of felt a little out of place. All right, cool. The chat box is working. Probably a little bit um hard to read behind that. Yeah. Yeah, what you gonna do? How's it going, Bright Fang? Hello, hello, hello. Welcome, welcome. I thought we'd watch uh, the new Assassin's Creed trailer. I don't know if you're a fan or not of the series. I think people f kind of fall in and out of love of it. Like, they burn out on one game and then the other. But I think... The latest games have been very good. Uh, Origins and Odyssey. I've been calling it Oranges. Assassin's Creed Oranges. Alright, let me see. Maybe I can make something uh, darker. The background, maybe. Background. It's boxed. What's that, though? Oh, yeah. That's better. Oh, yeah. Do I get to pick transparency, though? Isn't something about? Can you guys see a bit better now? Oh crap! It's all over my alerts up there. Why did I put my alert box up there? Who knows? I think I just wanted to put it over myself. There you go. Anyway, how are you guys doing? Thank you for the host, Dynamite. Hopefully the music's not too loud. I play Assassin's Creed Black Flag. That's one of my favorites. That is definitely one of my favorites. So I'm right there with you. Let's grab that alert box and get you out of there just for a second. We'll move you down here beside my. She won't be in the way too much. All right, cool. Cyber, hope you have an amazing day. Hello, Goga. I am. I hope you're all doing good. I was feeling like crap yesterday. Whenever I start to get almost sick, my my throat glands swell crazy. So I know that's my cue to like take a step back for a second, you know. So I'm not doing too bad, especially with these days. You just don't want to let your immune system drop too low. Yeah, I'm having the best of days. Oh, that's that's lovely. I'm so happy that you're happy, Goga. That's all that matters. I'll be back in a bit. No worries. You're watching Kyrox. Awesome. No worries at all. We're going to do this for just for a little half an hour or whatever. And then I'm going to play some GTA San Andreas. If you guys are down for that. I've been threatening to do it for a while. Today, Street to Rage 4 also came out. So there's a lot of hype around that as well. So I'd like to do that too. God damn, that chat was so easy to fix. God, don't you love when shit actually works like that? Um, Alright, cool. Don't worry, bro. You're trying to support everybody. You're incredible. For someone who doesn't stream themselves, my god. You are like, like, people like you and other people who don't stream are just there. Like, like, uh, a lot of people, you know. You, you're so important to streamers. You have no idea. Everybody's important. I love all you guys and you're, you're far too kind to me. Um, but, you know, when you're, when it's something out of your day and you're just there to watch, that's crazy. It's hard to juggle everything. Since I'm in a good mood, I'll listen to your stream while I do my homework. Nice. I got some nice uh, Dr. Monsters. They usually go invisible, not so more, much anymore. But they're little tiny cans, and I love them. They're super, super refreshing. Oh, Megan, hello. And John. John with the host. Let's go. 
How is everybody doing? I'm, I'm feeling so hype right now. We're just going to watch the trailer for the new Assassin's Creed Valhalla. I had heard that it was called Ragnarok. And I was actually... If I could, let me check my my files. <laughs> let me check my files here. Files me arse. I swear, having more monitors is a hindrance. You spoil yourself. I used to have. I don't know if I. I when did I? I think I was doing a uh, one podcast. I need to get back on that. I will. I will. I promise you. It was not just. It was always meant to be a one uh, once a month thing anyway. But I've been. I've always wanted to turn it into like a daily morning game show or something you know not game show that sounds wrong a game talk show i don't know where it is it might have even been on my old computer when that one died i lost stuff that i didn't know i lost you know that kind of way new assassin yeah exciting exiting exiting stage right i i actually type exiting a lot too my goodness horizon zero dawn is finally getting a sequel yes it is what do you think they're gonna call it megan hopefully that music's not too loud what will they call it? Now, I've heard that it might be a launch game. Woo! Uh, now that Assassin's Creed uh, Valhalla has shown itself off, uh, Xbox have pushed that news as well. So they're going to be doing a huge next-gen conference next week, uh, May 7th. I know you might not be a big fan of Xbox. That's fine. That's fine. But this is the whole industry moving forward and i am so happy i put out a tweet a lot of you guys liked it and retweeted thank you so much i put out a tweet exactly what i was feeling in that moment i was just like thank thanks be the god for game developers keeping me sane because i am going crazy right now i am like cuckoo like i only had a few screws tightened up here now they're gone oh they're not just loose they're flying off the handle hello eric hello hello i'm hyped me too i love games i'll, I'll i don't think i'll ever get sick of them might burn out on one or two of them, but damn, it's the one thing that stayed with me since I was four years old. And uh, I love it! So through all this shit, the game devs have been still hammering away at stuff. We might see a lot of delays and it sucks, but we gotta understand these are unbelievable circumstances. I'm not seeing the trailer, okay, cool. It's pretty short. I haven't really seen it either. I was watching the live stream where Boss Logic actually made this... Uh, Concept art in the background it took him like six hours. That's how they revealed the game. This was all done by a, a, a graphics designer a digital 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 drawer. I don't know. I don't know what they call themselves if fire lily was here She'd smack me over the head with a newspaper because uh, she's a good little drawer Anyway, sorry. I'm not used to being over here <laughs> I'm so stupid. Anyway, I won't keep you guys too long. We're gonna play some GTA San Andreas after this as well All right, let's hopefully the chat bar won't cut it off. There we go. Lovely jubbly Let's, uh, I can hammer up the volume now. Uh, okay, cool. So, yeah. the We don't have a, a, a release date yet. Only because the new consoles don't have a release date. But it is coming to everything. It's coming to this generation. It's coming to next generation. I don't think it's coming to Switch. But it is coming to that Stadia. Which, ugh. But this cool thing that might actually change the tide of next gen. Is Xbox, right? Xbox are actually... They're pulling off something very cheeky. They've always been champions of backwards compatibility, and they're no slouch. That we're gonna have like four generations on the Series X. It's a stupid name. I mean, I'm just gonna call it the XX or the Sex. <laughs> but one cool thing is forward compatibility. They're calling it smart delivery, which is probably a stupid name for because people don't understand what you're talking about. But what it means is if you buy the game once. You got it on all their systems. Probably not 360. <laughs> but on, you'll have it on Xbox One and Xbox Series X. So this is really cool. I, I You know, a lot of... We've had cross-play before. We've had that kind of stuff. Uh, but this is really cool. So far, Cyberpunk 2077 has signed up to Smart Delivery. And so has Assassin's Creed Valhalla. You buy that... You get it on everything. So that's their way of creating this easy window to jump through and get, like, uh, you know, the Xbox Series X. Maybe next year, maybe the following year. But they don't care. Once you buy the game, it's money in their pocket. And you'll have a 4K 60 frames edition waiting for you when you get over there. Am I behind the video? You dirty bastard. All right, let's go. Sorry, sorry. I'm going to keep it on loop anyway, so we're going to break it down. i got a, a couple of stuff we can... They are we can talk about. Here we go. Oh man, the fucking ooh, a royal borealis Godless straight away. Barbarians. Let's see, does it have subtitles? Nope. Sorry. They murdered 
murder and kill blindly. Pillage and plunder! They scar the lands of England. Lands they will never defend. Never love. The time has come to speak to them in a language they will understand. Oh, please! He just, he just fucking behead that dude. Come on, Assassin's Creed. Don't be afraid. Give me that R rated. Oh, I saw a leg go flying. Death of the Viking Elder. Bloodless. Odin, it's with us. <laughs> the old man, yeah. The hilt of the axe. A fucking hidden blade. Was that the hit? Yes, the hidden blade. What is the soul of man? You fool. Think like a Viking. Like a Viking. All right, holiday 2020. Nice. Look at all the Xbox stuff, yeah, so it looks like Xbox are going to be the marketing partner. Damn, that was fun. The Way of the Berserker, it looks like there might be some Animal Tames, kind of like the Far Cry series. We'll see about that. Well, you could do that in Odyssey. Jeez, that is a fantastic trailer. Doesn't it remind you so much of the show Vikings? Oh my god. If you guys haven't seen that show yet, now is the time, now is the time. It's so good, he even, he even looks like the main character Ragnar. Cool. Now, I had heard that this was more about you were actually being a Templar, but we'll see. After playing, like, Hellblade, God of War, like, it's all about Norse mythology. Holy shit. And there's a good chance that we'll probably get the next God of War next year, 2021. It's coming along lovely. That's called Ragnarok. And I think there was a little bit of infighting about that. Like, Ubisoft wanted to call this Assassin's Creed Ragnarok. Then its code name was Kingdoms, because you will be in control of Kingdoms. Another 100 hour Assassin's Creed game. I'm hyped. They took a break last year. They have been saying that we could have Watch Dogs and Assassin's Creed Valhalla in the same couple of months. That's kind of crazy. Desert, what's this? What's this? Hello, hello, hello. This is Assassin's Creed Valhalla. They just announced it today. The new Assassin's Creed. Doesn't feel like an Assassin's Creed. No? Which which part? They're definitely following the newer games. Yeah, the hidden blade. Hell yeah. I think after Black Flag and, and Black Flag included, that was kind of the end of the normal Assassin's Creed games. I mean, you're a pirate. He wasn't even an assassin. He picked up an assassin's hood and all that kind of stuff. Edward Kenway is still one of the best. 
All right. Sorry, I was totally getting into that. Don't make fun of me, poor grammar. No, that's that wasn't grammar. It's a typo. Now, when Assassin's Creed 3 was coming out, they had like uh, scalpin. That was the one with the Native Americans versus the British and that. They had scalpin in in that and everything, and they took it out because they were afraid of the you know backlash. I suppose they were right in a way. Anyway. This is pretty much coming on fucking everything. I heard that, yeah, I thought it'd be all gods and shit, yeah. There was some mention of Odin, right? Um, I think some of the powers, you know the way? You've got little powers in the game. I think there may be mention of Thor and Odin. Oh, JJ, how are you doing? Who's that? DPG, hello. I never know which one of these are using the goofies. I've, I sent some Viking sex. Maybe. Maybe. Cassandra in Odyssey was... She didn't give a fuck. She was very like Geralt. She just slept with whoever she wanted if the, if the need arised. There was a bit where... One, one quest where uh, she ended up sleeping with the blacksmith and all this. It's a really good quest. Choice like an Odyssey male or female? I don't think so. I don't know. I don't think so. It would be cool though. Female Viking. That's a, some fight with this guy. Holy shit. I know it's like they're bringing the battlegrounds back from Odyssey as well. It's nice to see the Hidden Blade get a little more front and center because I'm kind of getting sick of how much it's just pushed to the side now. I don't think we've even got proper double Hidden Blades in years. Yeah, this will be this will be the black flag of this generation. Black flag came out um, and it released on fucking uh, 360 and Xbox One at the time, which was crazy. Afraid to put. Yeah, the scalping. Yeah. Meanwhile, in Mortal Kombat, right? Yeah, was he there? Two different things, right? Ubisoft, are, they wanna they're, they're the guys who made the rabbits and all that shit. They wanna try and get as many uh, players as they can. Whereas uh, Ed Boon's like, this is how I fucking see it, and this is how we made it. I think the last AC game I played was Rogue. Rogue was fun. A lot of people did not play that game. And it made me sad. Rogue was really fun. That was... Uh, it was kind of like Black Flag 2 almost. But you played as... You played as a Templar. An ex-assassin turned Templar. Trying to get revenge on his brethren. I li I really liked it. Didn't Wasn't he like... In is he Scottish or something? No, hold on now. Oh, it's because it's full screen. There you go. Uh, why did you Why did you close down everything? Sorry about that. All right, so this is uh, from Tom Phillips over on Eurogamer. They've been pretty good. I don't really chime in too much with them. I, I pretty much follow nearly all the bigger outlets, but they don't really give you much information. It's all circle jerking now, but this seems to have some good information on, on it. Anyway, I'll read alongside just Don't worry. All right, let me see. Uh, I think they've been talking about Wessex, I think. Spending some quality time in Norway. Valhalla Saga begins. Uh, that's the way things weren't. So, Alfred, the, I think that's his name, isn't it? Alfred the Grated or something like that. We got the Saxons in there. All right, so it takes place mostly in Britain. Back then, you know. King Alf, that's probably who got killed in the trailer. Viking Saxons, various other groups living in Britain. I wonder will the barbarians from Germania come into it? They're like fucking crazy. They eat people and stuff. All right, I'm just skimming this. Let me see. Is there anything worth to them? The new village settlement hub. So we're gonna have this kind of kingdom building. That's why the code name for it was Kingdom. Uh, I don't know why this like giant rogue lady. <laughs> Fuck's sake! Damn it! <laughs> hey ghouls butt wait what was what was butts for open your butts why is that one not working it should work goofy just worked was it butts god damn it maybe it's not butts anymore was it just butt i think it might have just been butt i don't know how's ghouls doing today cyber i'm big welcome back welcome back
All right. I was reading something else and he explained a little bit. A home for main character Ivor. I think that would be probably how you pronounce that game. Beak. I'm glad it didn't work because you were talking. Don't worry, I'm always talking. I don't know why it's not working. Maybe it's just butt. Some of them break. Like that milk one was broken for ages. Wipe there your it is. feet and get your butts in the seats. <laughs> Do it. You shut your butt. I'm just kidding. Open them up. Open your butts. Open your butts for love. <laughs> Honk in the name of love. I'm just watching the new Assassin's Creed trailer. I don't. If you guys are a fan of um, here you here's his name. Ivor the Bearded. I like that. You're either bearded or unbearded. Yeah, if you watch the show Vikings, you, which you should, it's a, a fantastic series. Oh yeah. Don't know if it's exclusive to Hulu or any of that kind of stuff. Nice. Uh, reminiscent of Skyhold in the Normandy. Players return to time and again. You know, your village new buildings will be available to customize and upgrades such as barracks, blacksmith, tattoo parlor. Cool. I've heard that there's Viking rap battles. I shit you not. I swear to God. Do you remember the songs on the ships in uh, Black Flag and that? There's supposed to be rap battles in this. I don't know if you want to call them rap battles. <laughs> when I heard that, man, I, it cracked me up. I love those uh, league videos and stuff you posted, Gold. I don't know how I missed that show, but I did. Dirty Gooly. She is. She's always been. She pleads innocent, but she's the dirtiest of her soul. Singular butt. Oh, wow. You kind of like one cheek lifted for a little toot toot. Is that it? Do -do, 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 do you know how hard it is to fart on stream? It's very hard. You, you, like John, John fell into that nasty trap. You could lift a, a, a cheek and you never know what's going to come out. Could be like the dam breaking. Uh, I think I was being cut off there a little bit, was it? I'm going to play some... Uh, uh, some GTA San Andreas after this. I've been dying to play it. I farted on stream plenty of times. Yes, but they're all silent and deadly, right? Excuse me. <laughs> you say it afterwards. No, it's an excuse me to my ass. <laughs> I, I tend to do that. You know when you're trying to get round people in a restaurant? Oh, excuse me. Bray Fang, what are you doing? Ten gifted subs. Oh my god, dude. What are you doing? Sweet Jesus. 10. I know you're up to 21. Oh my God. I think you just broke the leaderboard. Thank you so much, Bri. Jesus, man. You're... Okay, you're, you're going to have that going forever. I love it. Oh, yeah. We're going to get Matthew Broderick out here. Come on down. He's been doing fuck all lately. Shout out to you, Bri Fang. You're fucking awesome, dude. Oh, yeah. I knew he was going to do that. <laughs> What? That's all I ever say. You don't have to do that. All the sub hype. He pretty much got everybody. Wow. People I haven't even heard of before. I love it. <laughs> Yay. Thank you so much, bro. Put a big smile on my face. Who hasn't tooted on stream, right? Liars. That's who hasn't. Big liars. Jesus. Jeez, that, that is huge. You did not have to do that. I don't deserve that kind of stuff. I only got one crappy little emote. It's just me being a shithead here. Damn it, I think I'm going to have to cut off. Yeah, that's going to go forever. I love that. I'm going to cut this off because the ads are a bit ridiculous. It's fine. I'll put it back. I'm trying, I'm trying to skim this real quick so I won't be all day on it. Oh, yeah. Make a GG emote already? Yeah, I know. I will, I will. But I see so many GG emotes already. Like, damn it. Maybe I'll make a Virginia genus. Virginus. Yeti! There's Yeti. How's it going, Yeti Machete? How are you doing today, Yeti? Just came in the middle of a huge fucking sub bomb. Thank you so much, Brayfang. Ten gifted subs. I think that's the first time anyone's ever done anything like that. You guys are so fucking kind to me. Thank you. Oh, yeah. <sighs> Goes GG emote will be my next thing. Goody whisper to me saying she almost farts and tries and covers up by laughing. I knew it. Yeah, she says it's bong rip rips, but I think it's actually ass rips. I'm telling you. Mm-hmm. Mutes for toots. Always. Is this guy supposed to be Odin? 
that's so Raven. That's why they showed up the Raven, and that's why they showed up uh, the old man. Odin's always the old man. What have you done now, you mad job? 1060 bits? I love it. It's so random. Thank you so much, dude. The bitties! Damn, you you hit up ghouls as well. Bro, you're too kind. You gotta hold on to your money. Things are weird right now. We don't know what's going on. You're being far too kind. Bitty! Sprinkle all the bitties. I would like to get that bitty sprinkler without the jar. You know the thing that fills up the jar? Just get rid of the jar and just have them sprinkle all over me. Oh, yeah. Just start fucking sharing with the bitties. Oh, yeah. Yep, I'm gonna wash my balls. <laughs> there it is. I found this and I kind of like it. It's one of those weird illusion gift things. Taking a dab, tooting a brap brap, right? Imagine if your asshole made those noises. Brap brap. Oh, excuse me. Excuse me. <laughs> it's like trying to get a lawnmower started. <laughs> oh, God. I love a good fart joke. Oh, there's Yetis, little Yetis. I love those. Yeti! It's such a cool little Yeti. I love the Yetis. We got so many fucking awesome emotes now. When I scroll down through my emotes, I see all your lovely channels and I, I love it. The Ghouly Rage one. Brand spanking new. That's one angry ghost. Do you think like farts are actually just angry ghosts trying to escape your body? There you go. I put that to you, chat. <laughs> Leave my asshole! Thank you for the host, EPG. I thought you did that earlier, my joke. Anyway, I don't think there's anything else. Let me move over there. I think I could bookmark a couple of stuffs. Uh, we'll watch the trailer one last time. I don't want to keep these too long. I'm running on. I said a half an hour. So I take too long with these things, right? All right, here's IGN. Oh, oh, wealth of knowledge that is IGN. Where have you skimmed it from this time? These guys got into some serious hot water. It was probably a good while ago uh, now. About stealing reviews. One little motherfucker. He's, he, they sacked him immediately, but the damage was already done. Don't you love when you peel back the bandage and you gotta keep going? It's like, oh, Jesus Christ. You gotta stop. And it hurts so good. Yeah, they're flighting. It's called flighting. This uh, Viking rap battles. Jesus Christ. Alright, according to an official description. Sail across the icy North Sea to discover and conquer the broken kingdoms of England. Immerse yourself in activities like hunting, fishing, dice, and drinking games. Or engage in traditional Norse competitions like flighting. Or as is better known, Viking rap battle! Oh, I can already see the Honest trailers now. Or Tobuscus trailers. Did he still do them? He probably does, but you know. They're all tainted. Tainted by shit. Taint! I put on the gookie was framed, right? Or maybe you could, you could change it to Gooky has fired it. It works. You're always that cooler. I, I, I got one. I got one. When are we going to start playing? In about like 10, 15 minutes. 10 minutes. 7 minutes. We're going to do it. I can move over. Everyone's ready to go. Beans are secretly the exorcist. I like that, right? They're not just a musical fruit. I should take them on tour. Fun. Fucking crop dust in over 50 states. Cyber's inner predator came out there. <laughs> oh! <laughs> I was trying to do, trying to do fucking chewy there. No, I leave that up to the yeti. Uh, oh, 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 I think he means like. Well, I'm gonna play GTA San Andreas now in a minute. But if you mean actual GTA, yeah, I used to actually do GTA online streams, and I did have a character called Monkey Humps. I want to get it back, my Monkey Humps. And let me tell you, I wasn't just a man in a monkey mask. Humping everything that moved. I was much more than that. I was an Irishman in a monkey mask. Humping everything that moved. Oh, yes. <laughs> monkey humps. Oh, wee, oh, wee, oh, wee. Yep. It was good times. Good times. Unbelievable amount of chafing. You have no idea. Oh, my God. The wardrobe department. Ugh. I remember one time. I was playing with ghouls and she... She drove off. And I exited the vehicle. Well, it was doing about 30 miles an hour. Good times. Monkey humps got monkey scares that day. Uh, IGN review. Six out too many Vikings, right? Too, th I think that was for a random Pokemon game, the Too Much Water. But it has stuck with them ever since. God bless them. Ghoulie has tooted, right? Tooted. My tooting is framing me, right? <laughs> I was tooted on. <laughs> I was tooted on by Ghoulie. 
Love it. April 30th, 2020. Well, she, she walked up to me and I thought she was saying hello, but she turned around and tooted on me. I felt it. I could taste it. Weird. It's getting it's getting too weird now. All right. Let's see what we got here. The Celtic stuff makes me happy. Maybe we'll get some crazy fucking pagan gods or rituals. That would be great. I'm always down for a bit of that, you know? A little bit of fucking bloodletting. What's a bit of bloodletting between friends? But Thierry Noel, historian, inspirational content advisor. Oh, excuse me. So this is not being handled by the Odyssey team. I think it's the other guys, the uh, Ubisoft China. I can't keep up with them. They're employing nearly 5,000 people now. It's insane. Okay, let me see. They were a fascinating society in terms of culture. Pretty fair in the way they treated women, who had important rights at the time. Certainly contradictory to the common image we have of Vikings. That's true. And the whole horned uh, helmet of Vikings. Complete bollocks lie. They never wore horns on their, uh, on, their, on their helmets at all. It was all just nonsense that got filtered down through movies and, you know, colouring books. It's always those fucking colouring books. Damn it. I love the adult coloring books. Now, what color should I make this genitalia? Ooh. <laughs> the boy who cried toot. I love it. That's brilliant. That is brilliant. Was it a toot? Wasn't it a toot? But when he did actually toot, nobody paid any attention. The whole town was crop dusted that year. In my day, we crop dusted ourselves. I'll be here looking. No worries, Yeti. Thank you for, for hanging. I know it's like uh, really early for a lot of you guys. I will die, will will always. Ah. You playing you play GTA on PS4? I do, I do, I do. Why is Toot? Toot? Hello Toot. I can't believe you guys don't know the 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 what are they called? Maynard? Maynard wine gums. The toot about the hoose. There's a moose. Who's loose about the who's? Uh, let me see. It says something about screenshots. Is these the only ones they got? These are all just screenshots from the trailers, you little wankers. You little wankers. Doesn't that look like Last of Us Part 2? My goodness. Yeah, so it's we're going to have like a Norse hard on for a while. Look at that Aurora Borealis. Oh, yeah. These are all from the trailer. That's not good. Let me see if I can find some more. Definitely, definitely Norse hard on. But we're okay. We like we like a good Norse. I like a good Norse hard on. Jesus. Huh? Put a little Viking helmet on your dick with little horns coming out of it. Charge! I do what I want. Just don't put the helmet up upside down. Oh, I get myself a Prince Albert. Totally intentional, of course. All right, let me see. I had um, yeah, there was. I had a couple of images back when it was it was called uh, Ragnarok. That's right, Cyber. Try and swallow as you talk, you jammy git. I'm getting nervous now. Nervous. I, I did the nervous toots. Uh, the book was based on me, sadly. The boy who cried toot needs to be a book, right? A children's book. I'm so sick of this fucking Humpty Dumpty. Who gives a shit about an oversized egg man who falls over, spills his brains out ever? That's kind of fucked up, actually. Let's get over to the boy who cried toot. I don't get that. Does he toot when he cries? Or that when he cries, a noise of a fart, he farts out his mouth? I don't know. Damn it, so I have so many questions. You've left me with so many questions. I I truly hope you're happy. Where are you sending me, IGN? You're getting no clicks from me, you little bit. Okay, these are the same ones. Yeah, it looks like there's going to be some awesome fucking fights. They're finally bringing snow back as well. I don't think we've had snow really since... Um, was it Assassin's Creed 3? Yes, because Origins... Or Oranges, I like to call it Oranges. That was... Egypt and then Odyssey was Greece. Oh yes. Oh yes. Here we pillage and plunder. Me and the boys pillaging and plundering. Awesome. I'm just gonna be staring up. It, it definitely like I haven't played Skyrim in years, so it's definitely giving me those kind of vibes. But that's Skyrim was based on uh, on Norse. Who knows when we'll ever get Elder Scrolls 6. That looks beautiful. Now the game will not look out like that. Just saying. So it's gonna have a really nice you're going to be going from, like, Norway down to Britain. That's, that's going to be very cool. Like, and the sizes of the maps, you'll probably be going to Denmark and everything. You might be able to stop off in Ireland. 
they'll find us there humping a couple of potatoes and just be like, keep, keep, keep rowing, quick, fucking Jesus, what's he doing? <laughs> we worship the spud and all its innards. That looks beautiful. I can't wait to get the Viking longships and the sails. Oh, man. Sorry, I'm just trying to segue away from the potato humping. Don't mind me. Damn, look at that fucking armor. They do some great jobs. And, and what do they call those? A flanged mace or something? Flange. Can I just keep saying flanged? We got some double axing. Nice, nice. Yeah, he looks like Ragnar from Vikings. Oh, dear. We should play. Yeah, hell yeah. So have you heard of the Pussy Chronicles? I, well, I, I'm going to read every one of those. Every page is glazed over, right? <laughs> As his eyes get glazed. Now I realize when they say your eyes get glazed over when you're stoned. I never understood that. Now it makes perfect sense. Then you cry one little tear of glaze. Holy crap. You're completely destroying my whole fucking mind right now. <sighs> There's nothing uh, in the rhyme that states Humpty Dumpty was an egg. Just to leave you with that dark image. Ooh, that's even better. But if you cracked open... It Same with um, Jack and Jill. They broke their crown. That means they they cracked open their head as well. A lot of people cracking their heads open. Yes. All right, that, that's all they got for now. Um, but I, I I think you guys I don't know if you guys are here when I'm saying it, but this game is gonna follow the smart delivery as they're calling it. I wish Xbox could actually get off their ass and come up with good names for stuff. But basically, if you buy this game on Xbox One, you're gonna get it for free if you get an Xbox Series X down the line. I wish PS4 would do something like that or PS5 or Sony. But they won't. They don't fucking care. That's really cool, right? So far, Assassin's Creed have signed on to do it, and Cyberpunk 2077. Both probably have the marketing with Xbox. You know, they're sh shilling out all that money. So the smart delivery is basically like an easy choice for them. The same with the Game Pass stuff. The Game Pass has been super nice. Super. All right. Uh, where did the YouTube go? Are you tops? I think it is it still here? It is. Alright. Let's watch the shadow one last time, then I'm done. Alright, there's nothing really else I can say. It's coming this holiday to everything, to Stadia. I don't think it's coming to the Switch though. Uh they don't they won't give a proper release date right now because they're waiting for the PS5 and Xbox Series X to give us a release date. That's basically what it comes down to. Simple marketing stuff, you know. And and they're, they're probably gonna try and find a way to get that going with a... Uh, What's it called? Watch Dogs Legion. I love that we're talking about fucking weird ass uh, nursery rhymes. It's so true, right? They're all dark as shit. Same with Disney. Disney robbed everything, but the if you go back and actually go through them all, the the original Brothers Grimm stuff, it's like, holy shit. This is so fucking weird. Like, a lot of them, the, the witch, the witch kind of sound like the story of Baba Yaga, who used to just eat ki kids, as you do. Not in the rhymes of Humpty Dumpty. Wait, that that's what's wrong? Oh, there's nothing in the rhyme. Okay, I thought you meant something that rhymes with it. Rhymes with anthrop anthropomorphic egg. <laughs> I don't know. I could make it work. <laughs> Humpty Dumpty. <laughs> yeah, it wouldn't make it wouldn't be right, wouldn't it not? Anthropomorphic egg fell off the wall and bumped his head. <laughs> hey, it's about time we start teaching these kids about anthropomorphic shit. Damn it. Why has there never been any anthropomorphic shite? Like, you know? Poop emoji is the closest we ever got to that. Wait, no, I think I'm pressing the wrong one. Is it alt? Anthropomorphic do 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 Go ahead, mother goose. Excuse me? Please. No bestiality here, goes. I already got warned once about Elton John. Can you feel my titties tonight? Woo! I'm just saying. I'm just saying I had a chub while I was watching. I had a chub while I was watching Lion King. Do you know what? I watched it the other day again. Same chub, same place. 15 years later. I tell you, kinks never die. Alright, let's watch this one last time. <laughs> We're all good. It looks so much like Hellblaze. Well, I fucking can't wait for that too. Checks TOS. Oh, I'm telling you. I threw out TOS. You see the new updates to Twitch? I hope that's not all they've updated. They just added an esports tab and a music tab. 
That bit's so silly. Like we know, we know well that they they didn't just pillage and plunder. They fucking raped everything that wasn't they nailed down. The lands of England. But I suppose lands they will never defend. They're trying to show a different never side, right? Love. Maybe all that's fucking fake to them. The time has come to speak to them in a language they will understand. Go ahead, Mother Goose. John Goose here. You could create your own, like, think of, like, Untitled Goose Game meets John Wick with a Mother Goose twist. John Goose. I'd watch it. Yeah, it's a pretty short trailer. Uh, next week they'll probably show off gameplay when Xbox are doing an event on May 7th. So that would be good. Oh, Yeti too! Oh, you didn't have to do that. Yeti, you're, you're already subscribed, Jamajo. Thank you so much for the, for the sub gift. The gifted sub to Diaper J. Diaper J. Yeti's awesome. Yeti streams as well. If you guys haven't, please give him a follow. He's good. He plays. He's actually played a, a shitload of great games. I get very lucky every time I come in. He was playing Morrowind and Skyrim there for a bit. Speaking of Norse. Thank you, Gorge. Who's always got my back? That's a super nice feeling. Anyway, I don't want to spend too long on this. You know me, I'll warble on for ages. Odin, it's with us. So the next God of War will definitely be fighting Thor and maybe Odin or something, I don't know. Norse Celtic vibes. I mean, this is this is the dream Assassin's Creed game. I'd love a traditional Japan as well, but with Ghost of Tsushima coming in July, I'm I'm, I'm sorry. I'm just gonna stab him with that that handle. That's pretty fucked up. Ooh. Stop talking about my wick, right? I think I told someone about that that a wick is also something else and they're like what sorry what Cause people lick their fingers to put out the wick <laughs> I'm just saying I'm just saying all right well there you go